Guys, AHS here. When I seen this headline, I said this is a friggin' a national emergency. A white queen is missing. All hands on deck. Everyone is searching, man. Everyone is looking everywhere. Where is Savannah Gunnery? Where is the white queen? A white queen is missing. It's a national emergency. They still looking for Gabby Patino, man. Just get it, just get it, just get it, man. Is Serena Williams uh, get missing? It's a national emergency. Anytime a white person is missing, it's a national emergency. Mega Markle, anytime she goes missing, it's a national emergency. You stop what you're doing. Go look for that white queen. This is the headline of the national emergency. Today, turmoil, Savannah Guntry. White queen leaves today live broadcast early as Hoda Cotby will remain absent. No one gonna give a fuck about a Hoda, man. Everyone cares about the white queen, Savannah Guntry. I know TJ Holmes got a search got a search party going on. The search for uh, Savannah Guntry. Guntry sudden exit result in the NBC morning show. Now I'm missing both of his main anchor. Most people are uh, tuning in for Savannah. No one turning turning on for Hoda. Old ass man. As as um Cotby has been off the air for more than a week. I'm thinking, is um Cotby and see on them drugs like uh, Wendy Williams, man. When you offer more than a week, I started thinking drugs, drugs. Let's think of this article from page six. But, but when I went through this article, after I found out the real reason why Savannah Guntry is, is missing, I said NBC. I know you lose a lot of viewership, but you need to fire the White Queen. She is very disrespectful for the reason why she's absent for the fun of today's show. Savannah Guntry leaves today live broadcast early as Hoda Copy remain absent. No one don't give a fuck about Hoda, man. Everyone tune in to the Today Show to see the White Queen, Savannah Guntry. <laughs> no one cares about Hoda, man. But usually when you, when you hit on females, they absent. You think, are they protesting some shit a male did? Did Al Roker do something bad? Are they upset? We're not getting paid as much as the males. They upset about something. Anytime you see female take off, they upset about something, man. Let's get more in the article. This is Al Roker. Still going, man. Still going. Savannah Gunnery fled. From the Today Show mid-broadcast Tuesday amid her, her co-anchor holder. Caught me, unexplained absent. Like I said before, I'm thinking drugs, man. I wonder, is it drugs? Is it drugs? Hoda, is it drugs? Yes, it says he fled, man. I hope she ain't flee with uh with a prisoner like Vicky White. <laughs> like Vicky White. That's the correct officer that let out on uh, that bad dude on um, Casey White. He killed some people and he threw her ass some game. He threw Vicky White some game and Vicky White let his ass out of jail. No questions asked to go have sex. It was business as usual for Godfrey 51. Man, TJ Holmes. TJ Holmes went through game of ass. No doubt about it, man. A white queen? You better expect game for TJ Holmes. When she began hosting the NBC morning show at 7 a.m., but she quickly sparked concern. All them sips. All them sips. They, they all got a heart attack. Where is Savannah? Where is the white queen? Why is she absent? It's like random letters. <laughs> it's not random letters, man. Oh my God. A small concern among viewers, male viewers, when she failed to return after commercial break around 7.30. Damn, the Sims, they were nervous, man. I hope TJ Home didn't take her away. <laughs> hope TJ Home didn't leave Avery Road back for Savannah Guthrie. Don't hate the player, hate the game. Savannah Guthrie left the Today Show Tuesday live broadcast amid Hoda caught be absent from the morning show. Man, Hoda, if you're on drugs, go to rehab, man. Go to rehab. Uh, the third hour co-host, um, Chanelle Jones, who was filling in for caught be, then shared a health update about, about Gotry right before 9 a.m. Eastern. This is why they need to fire her ass. This is why they need to fire her ass. It has been an interesting morning for us. As we said, Savannah left early. She was not feeling great. Here we go. We know what's coming. We know what's coming, man. We know what's coming. Here we go. 
She took a COVID test and she failed that motherfucker. She failed that motherfucker. And it came back positive. Jones 44. Damn, they put out everybody age out there, man. God damn. Why is this an age story, man? Damn. She don't got COVID, so that'll do. Uh, explain alongside Al Roker and Carson Daly. She failed her COVID test. She got an F on that shit. Jones emphasized that as soon as the test result came back, Guthrie quit the show. She rushed home to rest up. She had no choice. She failed the test. When you fail the test, you get kicked out of school. They keep the ass out of school. So Savannah, we love you. Wishing you a speedy recovery. She concluded, I went with a sim saying, I'm dying, I'm dying, I'm dying. Savannah's gone. So what going on with one? So what going on with one? This is Guthrie third time battling COVID-19. This is why they need a fire ass. She's too damn friendly. If you catch COVID three times, you're too damn friendly, man. TJ Homewell loves somebody got you, man. She's too damn friendly, man. Too damn friendly, man. They're that fire ass for being too damn friendly, man. I think Biden got caught that shit like twice. I think Fauci got caught that shit uh, twice, too. We got Mayor in Miami. Kava, she caught that shit like twice. All the motherfuckers that catch that shit multiple times, they're friendly as fuck, man. Now they catch that shit multiple times. You're a friendly motherfucker. Stop being friendly. Having previously uh, contracted the virus in January 2022 and May 2022. So she'll kill that shit at least twice this year. In 2023, oh friendly ass, man. And she did not share any updates on social media Tuesday as she gave up Instagram for Lent. Let's look at Savannah Guntry. Sexy ass, man. Did that more. She's sexy, but she still need to be a fire. So Gucci previous battled the virus in January and May 2022. Damn. The Today host did not elaborate on when Gucci will return or who will take her place while she's gone. Another white person. Another white person. Gucci illness has re resulted in the show now missing both of his main anchor. No one care about Hoda. No one care about um, Hoda. Copy 58 has been off the air from both today and today with Hoda and Jen. I think that's um, one of the Bush on, on twin, twins. I think that's one of the Bushy twins. For more than a week, her last live show was on February, Friday, February 17th. Yeah, Hoda ain't gonna be back until she passed that drug test, man. She ain't gonna be back until she passed that um, drug test. Soon as she's about Guthrie, passed that COVID test, she gonna be, she gonna be back. So I ain't gonna be back quicker. So I ain't gonna be back quicker. The sick will make sure she heal up well. Neither cop B nor NBC has addressed her absence. Can't address that shit. It's privacy concern. But fans have been expressing their concern for her unusual long time off, especially since Cop B has been posting several inspiration quotes via Instagram over the last week. And I asked the question, is she giving away a lot of her stuff? They say Tyson she's gonna give away a lot of his stuff. You have to be worried. You gotta be worried. While Cotby is out, Jones, Daily 49, and Will, uh, I think, Geis, from, from Sunday today, Tom Lamas of World News Tonight, and third hour of today, co-host Craig Melvin. Craig Melvin got a lot of kids, man. <laughs> he got a lot of kids with that chick that uh, used to work at ESPN. Have all stepped up and filled in for her along, alongside Guntry for the early show, and Jenna Bulls Hager. Uh, for the fourth hour, yeah. The Sims are very concerned, man. Come back soon, Savannah Gundry. And uh, Hoda, stay off the drugs. So, folks, give me your, your opinion on this article. And don't forget to like the video. AHS here.